As temperatures continue to rise, we know more electricity will be used to keep cool. And we know when that happens, oftentimes ERCOT asks for people to conserve energy. Well, now there's a plan to help when there's peak demand. And TJ Parker is live downtown to explain. Good morning, TJ. Hey, Corlea, good morning to you. In recent years, we are no stranger to ERCOT asking for us to conserve power, especially when it gets hot, especially in those uh, summertime months. But now there's a plan to build what's called peaker power plants on land owned by Texas A&M. These pe uh, peaker plants would only run during times of peak energy demand. Texas legislators and private developers pitched the idea to the Texas A&M system to see if they would be able to offer up land for the project. This is all in response to the Texas Energy fund that was passed last year. The main goal, of course, is to prevent blackouts and brownouts, as well as provide an alternative source of energy when renewable energy sources are low. We had several people come to us and said, look, with all the campuses the Texas A&M University system has and all the property we have all over the state, why don't you offer that up? All right, so exact spots for these uh, plants have not yet been picked, and the project is still in its early stages, but certainly welcoming, and we'll let you know especially how this develops. We're live downtown this morning. I'm TJ Parker, KPRC 2 News. Thank you, TJ. Right now on Click to Houston, five ways to beat the heat in Houston this weekend. Just look for it on the homepage.